What's up guys? I'm in Orlando, Florida on International Drive and I'm gonna go check out a Reganata's Italian Buffet. The lunch special is $12.99, but I'm here for dinner, so it's $14.99. It's not very good reviews about this place, so I don't really have high hopes. But, you know, for $14.99, probably won't complain that much. So, let's go check it out. So let's check out the buffet. Here's the salad bar, there's some lettuce, some shredded cabbage, along with an assortment of toppings, variety of beans and vegetables, and some more toppings. There's definitely a weird variety of toppings on this buffet. Pasta salad, potato salad, and some salad dressings. Just your basic Thousand Island, Italian, Ranch, Caesar. And here we have some soups. There's a vegetable soup. Potato soup. Broccoli cheddar soup. And tomato soup. Assortment of croutons and crackers. They have a build your own pasta bar, so you can select your noodles, select your sauce, and then there's chicken or meatballs to put in there. A variety of Parmesan knots. Different choices of pizza. There's veggie, pepperoni, sausage. Those little cheese balls are awesome. Some random cookies. And the desserts. There's brownies, confetti cake, and a cute little assortment of desserts. Here's my first plate. I got a slice of pizza, a little cheese bite, a dessert, and something I don't know what it is. These little cheese balls are delicious. Mm. Right. Child's pizza. Okay. It's a lot better than I thought it was gonna be, that's for sure. Just cheese. It's a little piece. No. I don't know what this is. I don't know. A little ball thing. I mean, I really don't know what it is. There's like cheese in it. Um, it's not bad though. So, it's a little dessert thing. I don't know what this is either. Ooh, that's banana flavored. It's like banana and chocolate. That's actually really good. And I like how they're they're little. You don't need a lot of dessert, you know. All right, let's keep eating. Let's keep trying stuff. All right, we got a penne pasta with a creamy alfredo and a little bit of basil pesto. And then I'm just trying out the soup. So I got the veggie soup and I put a bunch of crackers in there. And let's see. I think this guy is coconut. And this one might be a little peppermint. Alright. Should we try the pasta first? Looks good. Mm. For 14 bucks, I'm not going to complain at all about it. Made to order. Mm. Yeah, that's not bad at all. All right, start soup. <coughs> Funny thing about the soup is there is uh, just random noodles in it. There's like macaroni noodles, a shell, just a little soup. Well, that's kind of blah. That definitely needs some flavor. We gotta find out what this is. I don't know. <laughs> Red? Is that a flavor? 
pretty sure this one's gonna be coconut, like a macaron or something. Yep. Lots of whipped cream in a cup over there. This pasta is actually really good. Mm. Never take more than you're gonna eat. And here, they'll actually weigh your food if you have a whole bunch of waste, and they'll charge you for it. So, keep that in mind. Alright, let's see what else we got. Alright, so this one, this one's an Oreo, this one's like a coffee, and I think this one's supposed to be like a panna cotta. And then just a little... Wow. It's just confetti cake, I'm sure. Cake. Oreo. Yep, it's a Oreo. I'm guessing this is fawn or like a panna cotta type thing. Yeah, probably panna cotta. It's an Italian restaurant. Oh, this is probably supposed to be like a plan to your Pretty good. Overall, I have no complaints, you know? It's 14 bucks for the whole buffet. What are we complaining about, you know? I would definitely visit Oreganatas again. The quality of food matches the price point, and it's a great location on International Drive.